signal lost. Anyway, what's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. Well, this is the result of a virus. The result of Corona. Entire outdoor shopping outlet with nobody around. So, with that being said, in today's video, in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys some tips and tricks on how to use your paddle shifters and some like hidden features in them. So, I'm gonna give you guys a verbal explanation and then I'll strap on the GoPro to my head and demonstrate it out for you guys. So, there are two things in particular. The first thing is called short shifting. The second thing is, I guess you can say it's double declutching. So, short shifting, if you guys don't know what it is, it's pretty much when you shift to the next gear before your car hits red line. So for example, you shift around 4,000 RPMs or maybe even 3,500 RPMs, maybe even 5,000 depending on your driving situation. So instead of waiting all the way to the red line to shift, you can just shift way beforehand and still like keep your foot on the accelerator. You pretty much get to control how much of the horsepower and how much of the torque you want because the higher your RPMs, the more horsepower and torque you're getting out of the vehicle. But sometimes you don't want all that horsepower and torque. So what you can do is to short shift. So I think most AMGs have this and it's like the double declutching system. So in my car, I have a nine speed automatic transmission. And what you can do is you can downshift twice. Like if you just double click, it'll instantly drop two gears. And why would you wanna do this double declutching method? Well, so that way, depending on what your driving situation is, you can get out of a lot of really tight spots like on the highway and stuff. So if you're able to drop from like fifth gear to third gear instantly, it's gonna save you some time. And as a lot of you guys know, timing is everything when you drive. Like anything can happen within a split second. So if you're able to drop two gears instantly, then you're able to have more access to your car's horsepower and torque. So we're gonna go into Sport Plus, manual, boom. And I will see you guys on the road. All right, so we're in Sport Plus mode. We're in manual mode and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about, so let's do this. So we're in fifth gear right now. I'm gonna do the double declutching thing I was talking about and that's simply just downshifting twice, like really quickly. So we're gonna go from fifth gear. Oh, I'm gonna do it under the bridge. Yeah, so it just completely drops to third gear. Like it didn't even wait at four and then go to three. It just went from five to three. And that's what's really good about this double declutching thing. Okay, so I short shifted there. First of all, because I didn't want to full send around a corner. Second of all, my traction control was on. So even if I wanted to full send, it would just kick in. And while I do this, and you guys are learning something new, definitely go out and try it. It'll help you become more experienced, you know? So I short shifted over there because I'm just trying to control the distance of my car between like the traffic lights and stuff. Because obviously you don't want to like gun it at 5,000 RPMs through a traffic light because it could turn yellow at any point and you have to slow down. Hopefully you guys learned something new today. 
If you did, make sure to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. I'll be coming out with as many videos as I can during this quarantine period just to keep you guys entertained. But in summary, take advantage of the double declutching system if you want to have more immediate access to your car's horsepower and torque. And for short shifting, you want to do that to help control the distance between your car and let's say a traffic light or the car in front of you or just because you just don't want to speed up any faster. So, word of advice, just go out and try it. If what I'm saying kind of makes sense, but not really, you have to go out and try it, and then you'll be like, oh, I understand, I know what he was saying. <laughs> Full send before we end it. Dump in the jump for the shit, I'll tap when I speak, I'll cap with the speech till they caught up in the rapture. I'm so out of line with the phrase game. Let's take a break, been a long day. Hit your line with your fall through with the light sticks. Maybe help me spark the ideas. We got nowhere else to go. So